This is ABC 15 Arizona at 4. Hey there, I'm Zach Crenshaw. Happy Friday and thanks for watching ABC 15 News at 4. We need to start with some breaking news this afternoon. A back and forth battle of words unfolding this afternoon between the Phoenix Suns and ESPN. It's all over allegations that haven't even been published yet. A tweet from basketball podcaster Jordan Schultz implying major accusations of sexual harassment and racism involving Suns owner Robert Sarver are expected to be posted publicly soon. Our Colin Harmon staying on top of these constant developments and Colin, the Suns already pushing back hard against these accusations. Yeah, Zach, that tweet teasing a bombshell story set the basketball world ablaze this afternoon and the Suns have since said it makes completely baseless claims based on lies, innuendo and a false narrative. Now, no details of the story have come out yet, but here is the original tweet from Jordan Schultz, who is not the author of the story coming out, mind you. Uh, the NBA preparing for a massive story accusing Suns owner Robert Sarver of racism, sexism and sexual harassment in a series of incidents, sources say. With enough evidence to support such claims, there's a real chance the league would forcibly remove Sarver. Now, Sarver responded with a lengthy statement saying he was wholly shocked by some of the allegations. Quote, first and foremost, I reject any insinuation of personal or organizational racism or gender discrimination. I despise language that disrespects any individuals, regardless of race, gender, preference, or choice. Such language has no place in business or at home in what I consider Sons and Mercury families. I am proud of our record of diversity and inclusion on both teams, whether on the court or in the front office, end quote. It has certainly been a rocky tenure for Sarver since purchasing the Suns from Jerry Colangelo in 2004. Sarver is not a well-liked figure amongst Suns fans, but these accusations are something else entirely. As for forcibly removing Sarver as owner, if the accusations are found to be true, Donald Sterling was removed as Clippers owner for similar accusations in 2014. Zach? Colin, yeah, and for some context here for you viewers at home, Sarver has been the Suns owner for more than 15 years now. The 59-year-old purchased the team in 2004. At the time, it was a record purchase price of $401 million for an NBA team. He's also the co-founder of Southwest Value Partners. Now, ABC 15 is looking to get in touch with current and former Suns players, as well as learning the specific details about these allegations against Sarver that ESPN is purportedly getting ready to publish.